Introducing the Plunderbug today on Hack 5. Hello and welcome to Hack 5. My name is Darren Kitchen. It's your weekly dose of Technolust, and I'm so excited because today is a Technolust day because we're releasing the latest Hack 5 gear. This oh, is a smart land tap called the Plunderbug. I'm, I'm so excited about this. this the, okay, so the Plunderbug, get this, is a smart land tap. It's something that I've wanted for myself for the longest time. It's a land tap that does so much more. Um, if you're probably familiar with land taps, if you've been working in cybersecurity or IT for a while, it's just a little device where the ethernet goes in one direction and then the ethernet comes out the other direction. And typically, then there is another ethernet where that then goes into your laptop. But of course, these days, who has ethernet on their laptop, which means that then you're standing on a ladder with a USB ethernet adapter dongle like like the land turtle. I've literally used this numerous times because I forget to pack one of these in my bag. Um, and and then you've got like cables going everywhere, whether it's a passive one or, or you know, whatever have you. And in fact, Mike Osmond's Throwing Star Land Top, really cool. I mean, the fact that it came from a PCB business card. Uh, but it, it's kind of cumbersome. And I've always wanted a land tap that does so much more like this, just a little pocket guy. Uh, so I did just that, making the, the plunder bug and I thought, you know what? It's time for a USB-C LAN tap that has the Ethernet adapter built right into it. So it's just one cable going straight into your laptop. And there's just so much less mess. Um, but then I thought, hey, you know what? This could get so much cooler because um, guess, guess what else is USB-C? Well, well I if you're like me, your rooted Android phone. Oh yeah, you can kind of see where this is going already, right? So once you have your Plunderbug LAN tap in line on the Ethernet, you grab your phone and it's going to say, oh, looks like it plugged a Plunderbug in. And you say, yeah, go ahead and open the companion app. I'm so excited for this because it's as simple as saying, record. And I must say, few simple things in life have made me this happy. Just the idea that you could stand here and be like, there we go, check the box. And then you go over to files and oh, there's all my PCAPs. And then you're just like, boom, let's go ahead and share this. And it's all the standard stuff. So I'm constantly emailing myself. Then again, what else is new? I mean, I've even found a PCAP reader for Android, which means you could technically do diagnosis on the go, which is just kind of crazy. <sighs> You know what else is crazy? I always forget to bring USB Ethernet adapters with me. I remember uh, Hack Across the Planet, I'm in Singapore and I'm like using the LAN turtle as a USB Ethernet adapter because it's the only thing I have in the hotel room. And so I wanted to take, you know, the plunder bug a step further since we have that USB Ethernet adapter built right in. Why not say, hey, when you're at the hotel and you've got a wired connection, be able to use it as such, not just a passive LAN tap. So there's active uh, mode and you can switch between those in Windows, Mac, and Linux, which then just uses it as a USB Ethernet adapter, which actually, I guess if you plug in another host, then you, you technically have like a, a three switch, three port switchy guy, which I will seriously use when I travel because I carry a Windows, Mac, and a Linux laptop when I do trainings and need to connect those guys. And so that's just another win. So it's three in one, or I mean, Okay, technically speaking, if you have a Ethernet run over 100 meters and you need to extend it and you have USB power somewhere, it's an extender of sorts, but uh, four in one, whatever. That's not really the intended use case. Doesn't matter. Point being, I am stupid, crazy excited about a LAN tap, but not just any LAN tap, it's the plunder bug. So I probably should have thought about that because now I'm going to need room for another poster in the new studio. Anyway, whatever. I love packet capture tools and I always use Wireshark for following TCP streams and statistics, but I also wanted to share with you another awesome little Python script that I found recently that get this, will extract files really simply out of those PCAPs. It's kind of like TCP extract, but it's more modern and it's got this plugin architecture and it's in Python, so it's really simple to add signatures based on different file types. I wanna show you that now. So this program is called PCAPFX and you can go ahead and just git clone it off GitHub and it's a simple Python here. And what's really cool about it is you just run Python dot slash PCAPFX and point it at a PCAP file, which I have on my desktop called test.pcap. And it goes ahead and analyzes it and then looks for all of the different files in all of these connections here. And oh, look, there's a file. There's a couple files. And it creates an output folder here. And then, you know, it, it does it based on file type. So in this PCAP, I've got a bunch of image files. And we can actually go in and take a look at like all of the various little 
different images that it found throughout the browsing session. And I'm like, hey, look at this. It's thumbnails and stuff. And there you go. Otherwise, there's a whole plugin system here where you can do the data recognizers and you can see all of the different file types. And it's just a matter of specifying the signatures for these guys, which is pretty cool. Well, there you go. As you can tell, I'm very excited about our new Plunderbug friend. And in just a moment, we're going to get into the Hack5 Gear giveaway, but first, a quick break. Domain.com has all of your website needs from .com and .net to intuitive website builders. Create your online identity with their affordable, reliable tools. Even brand yourself with over 300 extensions from .club to .space. Domain.com loves Hack5, which is why you get 15% off domain names, hosting, and email when you check out with coupon code HACK5. When you think domain names, thinkdomain.com. Now, if you'd like a chance to win a plunder bug of your own, or even better, a $100 Hack5 gift certificate for any of the awesome Hack5 gear over at hack5.org, leave a comment below and let me know about your favorite PCAP analysis tools or any other network monitoring tools. You can find the full details over at hack5.org slash contest. And if you're new to the whole realm of packet sniffing, Shannon has an awesome series on Hack Tip to learn the ins and outs of Wireshark. Seriously, it's like 32 uh, videos. It's so great. I'm gonna link to that playlist below as well. And yeah, with that, I'm Darren Kitchen. I will be back a little later in the week with the usual stuff, but until then, trust your technologist.